Hi, so welcome to my messy studio um, where I'm currently working on a sign for Earth Fest 2024, which is made 100% with waste, of course. In this case, I've mainly used corks for the background, and Living Street badge is kindly donated to me, <laughs> lots of them, um, for the actual lettering. Um, and it's fun to use, it's perfect, I think, for the job. 100% sustainable um, but it's interesting because um, at the moment I'm um, between this Earth Fest project which I adore of course it will take place um, between the 18th and the 21st of April in King's Cross Sky Square so please come along that weekend if you can because it's open to all the public there'll be lots of things going on it will be a beautiful event and it will um, tackle sustainability across different spheres so There'll be a lot of things to learn from me too, so I can't wait for that. But anyway, so I'm in between this, which is really more of a crafty thing, more than an artistic thing to do. It's really practical, it's huge, and you know, the method I use is very similar to what a normal mosaicist would do. Um, you know, tessera um, arranged in orderly ornamentos, uh, as orderly as they can be. Uh, but also, at the same time, I'm doing a few exhibitions, as you probably saw on the, around London. And I feel like I don't really belong there somehow. I mean, it's a beautiful network. I get on with everyone. And yes, we share, you know, of course, lots of uh, similar views. But uh, technically, I can see that, you know, my piece is completely different, of course. Um, it's not sleek, it's not smooth, it's not, you know, it's not one of those things that would really sell uh, in a group exhibition. Solo exhibitions, are, thankfully, it's a different thing, but um, different outcome. But so, and I know that, yet I still insist in putting them out there because, as you know, as an eco-artivist, um, my aim, my purpose is also that of sending a message and spreading it, you know, as far and wide as I can. Uh, and so there it is, you know, my odd piece in between um, all the others, uh, standing out, uh, not selling, <laughs> but, you know, making its its impact, I'm hoping. Uh, and then, you know, as a mosaicist as well, um, I'm really the odd one out. Uh, so it's really interesting how I'm an in-between. I never fit in the boxes. Uh, and yet again, I was thinking, why do artists actually have boxes to tick? Um, they shouldn't. It's, you know, in their nature. Because of their nature, they should be out of the box to start with. So I feel somehow a bit lonely out there. Um, and I wish there were, you know, more like me. Uh, not really caring to fit into boxes, not really fitting into boxes, you know, naturally, because this is what I do and this is what I want to do and this is what I'm passionate about, you know, because I'm Kunstwerk everywhere, all around. Um, so yeah, this is, I think, just a, a shout out for some company out there. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> it's just, you know, something that, a realization I had to share. 